Join Kids Hat Family. Hey, Tia. Yes, Tofu. My teacher wrote a report that I need to get signed by mom. What? Why? She said that I didn't do things as asked. Oh, why is that? Uh, I just thought she's giving instructions just like that. I didn't think there was any meaning to her instructions. That's not a good thing, Tofu. Yes. But why does she give so many instructions? And why do I have to follow them always? Hmm. I think you should follow your teacher's instructions otherwise you will experience something similar to Peter Rabbit. Why? What did he experience? Peter Rabbit Once upon a time there lived a rabbit called Peter Rabbit. He lived with his mother and brothers Flopsy, Mopsy and Cottontail. One day their mother told them that she was going out for some work. Children, I have to go finish some errands. Till then, you can go and play in the lane. Just be careful that you do not go to MacGregor's garden at all. You all remember that your father had an accident there, don't you? Mrs. McGregor had put him in the pie. Once their mother had gone, all the brothers went down the lane to play. Flopsy, Mopsy and Cottontail were very good kids and they followed their mother's instructions. But Peter Rabbit was a naughty one. He went to the McGregor's garden all by himself and squeezed himself under the fence. The garden was full of delicious vegetables. Wow! So many vegetables! I will eat them all! And quickly Peter Rabbit filled his stomach with lettuce French beans and radishes. Oh, I think I have eaten too much. I need some parsley to help my stomach. And so Peter went looking for parsley deeper in McGregor's garden. He was just crossing the cucumber patch when he ran into Mr. McGregor. Thief! Stop! Stop right there! Mr. McGregor ran after Peter trying to catch him. The moment Peter saw him coming, he took off. Oh no! I must run! If I get to the shed, I should be okay. Peter quickly dashed into the tool shed and dived into a can. The can was filled with water. But Peter had no choice. 
Mr. McGregor had followed him into the shed. Where did that rabbit go? Mr. McGregor couldn't find Peter anywhere and so he decided to check outside the shed. As soon as he turned away, Peter got out of the can and dashed out. But Mr. McGregor spotted him. There, that thief! After him! I won't let him go this time! Somehow, Peter managed to get away. He caught his breath and sat down under the blueberry bush. Just then he heard someone talking to him. Are you okay? Uh, can you help me find the way out of here? The mouse showed Peter the way out of the garden. Peter quickly got out of the garden and headed home. Good, you're home. What took you so long? Uh, nothing, Mom. I am just very tired. I think I will sleep. The mother was very surprised. She let Peter go to sleep early. At supper time, she made the children's favorite dinner. and served them the carrot pie that she had got for them from the market. But Peter Rabbit was so tired that he slept through the entire dinner and missed his favorite meal. Oh no! I don't think I ever want to experience anything like that. I will think twice before not following any instructions from my elders. That's awesome, Tofu. Come on now. We'll get you some carrot pie and then you can get the report signed by mom. Yes, let's go, dear. For your favorite rhymes, stories and more, join Kids Hat family. Subscribe here.